very important that we go through uh, the, the university side to participate in climate actions, to do youth empowerment, and also to help them to, to, to give them the platform to, uh, to get engaged in this climate action. So uh, actually leaving universities like, like the, uh, the, the GAUC, we are the top 15 alliances members around the world. And as you can see, I'm from uh, Tsinghua and Oxford, so I'd like to say that it is very important for us to serve as the, the university side that we provided them with both the platforms and also we have launched a, a, a project called the Climate X Leadership Project in June and we helped uh, uh, students from around 300 universities to participate in climate actions and we selected the top uh, you know, top uh, excellent 20 students to participate in COP28 offline. I would like to see that the project launched uh, just uh, in Obnisk is really amazing and I got very, very impressed by what was happening there. And I, li I would like to emphasize that it is really important for us to see the, you know, the, the interdisciplinary, uh, interdisciplinary collaboration. For example, students, they are from either energy transition part or they are majoring earth sciences or policy making and they can both sit together and they all sit together and then to discuss on the same agenda. I think it is very important. So as you know, I'm also part of the indigenous ethnic group in China. So I, uh, I, I got, uh, it is my privilege to have the chance to go to Union Geneva to participate in some event related to it and we're going to have some sessions related to it here as well. So my project at Impacting 2050 is quite related to this specific topic which is to empower the youth from indigenous communities around the world. Actually I do specifically from my, uh, the, the indigenous youth from my region and I think it is very significant like we put them, uh, we, 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 we bring them some educational resources, for example, the, the vocational education resources to them, and then we, we also help them to broaden their, like, like to, to promote their voices. Uh, for example, we have launched, also launched some uh, podcast projects, which is also part of the, the projects I'm, I'm launching in this impact team, and, and we are trying to empower the indigenous communities. Thank you.